we're back to looking at the 2024 recruiting class and we're going to shine a spotlight on four-star offensive tackle prospect Bennett Warren who signed with the Tennessee Volunteers. We're going to look at his highlights. We're going to look at his 24-7 sports player profile page. But before we do all that, you need to click that subscribe button because we're covering the 2024 recruiting class every single day this offseason, player by player. And that way you know what these recruits look like when they start making plays for your team. You'll know a little bit of something about them. Click that button. Stop missing out. But we're going to start off with Bennett Warren's 24-7 Sports player profile page. If you're here for just the highlights, fast forward a couple minutes. I guarantee you will get there. First thing you're going to notice, six foot seven and a half, three 324 pounds. Dude's huge. Four-star prospect, ranked as the seventh best offensive tackle in the class in the rankings, 11th best in the composite, four-star in both. But I like to look at the offers. That is my rating system. That's what I like to look at the most here. 35 offers. Look over here to the left. Top-tier Power 5 programs. Tennessee, Michigan, Oklahoma, Texas A&M, Auburn. That indicates to me that the market of college football thought he was a good prospect. It was hot for him. They're not going to chase him if they thought he wasn't a good player. That being said... He's a good prospect. We got a good rating here. Ranked 80th nationally. 7th offensive tackle in the class. College football saying he's good. Things are pointing to good things for Bennett Warren. All-American Bowl, Polynesian Bowl. We got our work in in those all-star games for sure. And now we're looking at the scouting report here by Gabe Brooks. Enormous offensive tackle prospect with elite height and length. Legitimate six foot seven plus with a wingspan beyond seven feet. That's massive. Ready to play mass, but wears the bulky fairly well. Plays with encouraging movement and ability relative to immense size. Size adjusted athleticism shows lateral range, more light footed locomotion than you'd expect for a tackle of his size. Displays effective kick pack and pass protection. Dude's huge. He moves well. Pretty much what they say. He's strong, long arms. I can't wait to see the highlights. I can't wait to see this guy on the field looking at the timeline. Tennessee all the way. And that's who he signed with. He's a four-star prospect. Going over to on three. Four-star prospect down the line with all the recruiting sites. They got him listed at six foot seven and a half, three hundred twenty-five pounds. Dude's huge. Dude's massive. We should be able to see him on the tape. On three has him ranked twenty-fourth among offensive tackles. Industry rankings ranked ninth. ESPN ranked seventh. Rivals ranked eleventh. Let's take a look at the highlights. Let's see what he's about. Make sure you hit that subscribe button so we can watch tape together all year long. Let me know what you think about them in the comments below. But it's time to take a look at the tape here. It, oh, he ate him alive there. And he pops off the camera. He's so big. He hit that guy and kind of bounced. He gets in a stance well for his size. That guy has no chance. Look at the size difference there between him and the defensive lineman. It's going to be really hard to get a good read on him due to the competition, especially on this first couple plays. We do not have a big sample here. Highlights, we may have to just run through him twice. He's a brick wall. You're not getting past him. Getting downfield. Again, he better be able to bully that dude. But he's huge. And we have to analyze the movement here. Gets a hold of, what, 77 there and moves him pretty easily. That He's not a small dude. He makes everybody look small, too. He finishes, guys. He's got a mean streak to him. That's a good thing to see. He does move quick for a size. You see him fire out there. That's exciting. We should be seeing this guy hit the ground, too. Oh, he lays on him hard. 
flops on him. Good kickback. Good pass, bro. Makes the guy eat dirt. Makes him eat dirt hard. He might have touched the devil there. He hit the ground so hard. There he goes again. Another belly flopper. Let's watch this again. It's only a minute and 30 seconds. That first play here, he kills the dude and lays on him. The second play, I want to look at the movement. We're pulling. He moves well for his size. He definitely does. Pretty quick there for his size. Let's just go back to that play. I normally don't do that. We usually just go through the highlights, but this one's so short. A lot of these guys, they got like 10 minutes of highlights. I want to look at this one right here. We're at the bottom here, right? Want to watch him pull. He's six foot seven and a half. That's what they got him listed on 24 7 Sports, 325 pounds or more. Just watch him move. Remember how big he is. He hits him. Moving down the line, he's got some speed to him for his size. Don't compare him to wide receivers, please, when it comes to speed. He's a big boy. He moves well for his size. Moves laterally well, too. Look at him get there. Fires out well. He puts his hands on you. You're going to the ground. If it doesn't work out in football, you can definitely be a bouncer because no one's getting past you, dude. Nobody's getting past To the second level, you see his movement. I want to see her, see him against tougher competition, and I want to see more than a minute and a half. I really can't give you a definitive answer on him. I can definitely tell you he's huge, he's strong, he's got a mean streak, like we're seeing there. He finishes plays because he's done that multiple times. We've seen him fire out a few times and have some quickness for his size, looking fast. We saw him pull on that play. We have small samples of a lot of stuff here. Of a lot of good... Oh, he, he smashes that dude in the ground. Ooh. But I need a larger sample to really give an accurate grade, an accurate assessment. What we're seeing here is very good. And he's a bigger dude. I want to see him against tougher competition. If I can find 1v1s of him out there, I'm going to post those up. I may have to do another video. What I do see is very encouraging. Very fun to watch. He's big. He's huge. Six foot seven and a half. Long arms. You're not getting around this guy. He's aggressive. He develops. He's going to be a major factor. Puts in some more time in the weight room up there. Major factor. This could be a big dude that's playing on Sundays. There's highly likelihood of that. And college football said that. Everybody tried to get him on their team. He's kind of lighting the rankings on all the recruiting sites for his size. I want to see more. I'm sure you do too. Let me know what you think about him in the comments below. Make sure you hit that subscribe button on the way out. I want to thank you for watching. Catch you on the next video.